Hi everyone, welcome back to the Casual Watch Review channel. So today we've got an unboxing. So this has been something I've been waiting for a while and I believe this isn't actually available in the US market yet. If we uh, show it here, we've got shopping in Japan, which is where it's come from. So I actually ordered this from Japan. Now I'm gonna do a review of my shopping experience with this website, very good. Once I ordered it, it literally came within less than a week from Japan, which I was absolutely amazed by. It's got all the custom, I was worried about customs and things like that, but we've got all the customs declaration forms on here. So I was very impressed so far. So I'll actually probably do a video where I review my experience and how I went about ordering this from the, but anyway, let's get started with unboxing this. So let me just, uh, Actually, what I'll do is I will I'll flip it upside down and open it from the underneath. Okay. So this is the this is the box here. Let's see what else we got in here. We got so we've got the shopping in Japan catalog there. Oh, some very good watches in there. So Orient watches these look like. Okay, let's get started with the unboxing. So there we go. So as we can see, it's a Seiko. So let's get this out of the box. So we've got the instructions here, which I think are actually gonna be in Japanese. So this, I actually ordered this from Japan, so this is the Japanese version of the watch, because it, it, I don't think it's actually out yet until February. So that's that. Got the warranty card here, so I'm not actually sure whether this would be valid in the US, but it's got its uh, Japanese warranty card there with the phone number in of, sh of shopping in Japan. So there we go. So if we look on the side of the box here, this will give a little little clue of what it is. So it's actually the SB, SBDC055, which is, if we open it, So it's actually, it's one of the Paddy Special Editions we can see there. So let's just get it, the watch out for us. Oh yeah, there we go. Wow. Okay, so, so there we go. So it's the actual, like the 62 mass uh, special edition on here. Wow, that strap's really nice. Got the, the wave on the back. So this is that similar design to the 62 mass re-edition. So similar case, etc. There's the prospects. We've got the, uh, the dia shield on there, which is a, a scratch resistant coating that Seiko are putting on their watches now. We've got the, the paddy seal on there, which is actually looks like a diver's tank, which is pretty cool. Got the prospects there. So we've got the band with the Seiko logo on there, Seiko buckle, but yeah, really impressed with this. Oh yeah, that really smooth, smooth bezel action on there. So I'm, I will do a full review of this on the channel after I've sort of worn it for a, for a few weeks, but I'm really impressed with this so far. Should have, um, should have manual wind on there. Oh yeah, very smooth on the manual wind there. And it should be hacking, which it is. Fantastic. Everything seems to look, everything seems to be aligned on there, which is pretty cool. Yeah, I just love the design of this with the red minute hand and the, and the arrow pointed hand. The strap feels really nice, actually. I actually bought another strap for this, which I'll do another video on when I add that strap to it. So there we go. So if you give me a couple of weeks to get used to it, I'll start wearing it and then we'll do a full review on it there, but very impressed so far. 
As always, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you all next time on the Casual Watch Review channel. Thank you. Bye.